guys, I'm the Toy Forever and you're watching another video by iPod King Carter. Don't forget to hit that like button and if you want to become a part of Team IKC, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below, boo. Alright ladies and gentlemen, I have to do a few things. I gotta go rally the black beard. Uh, it's time for me to get my allegiances up. So uh, first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and charge these good old wings. Then we're going yeah. to use this momentum though. I'm saying, get me where I need to go. Hold up, what's that? What's this? What's that? I don't know. Let me just, let me just fuck with it real quick, though. I hope there's not something ridiculous like a hundred of these to find. I got a, got one soul cluster. But it's a lot of them around. See, I'm gonna get off task. I already know how I am. Gotta find more of these things. Alright, let me just. I don't know what I'm doing right now, but I think I'm doing some good. Go. Yo, what, what was that? All right, let me get to where I need to go. Did I pass? Okay, here we go. Come on, flap your wings. Flap your wings, little bird. This is bad timing. You go too slow, okay. Anyone got a mop? Who's shooting at? Shoot, you a girl? You don't look like a girl. But we ain't gonna worry about it. Alright, where I gotta go? Charge him up. And I am here. I have arrived. Abandoned ship! We've been boarded! Ew! Get these damn things off my ship! Turn. This joint's stupid. What are these things? This is what I'm going to have to do. I got a bit of treasure in that chest over there. The weapon you find inside may help with a little imp problem. Alright. What we got for me? Ooh. 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 It's easier every time. So easy. Oh my god. Fuck off. Get off, you piece of shit. What are you 
I summoned these imps to serve as my crew. I forgot what a handful they could be. Once aboard, they wouldn't listen to their captain. They ran amok in the bowels of the ship. Right, I'm not worried about that. I'm just worried about... What the, the fuck? Who's that? Not another one of these. Good God, they're swarming me! Hey, it's okay to drop the pirate voice. What pirate voice would that be? Man. Wow. This is not good. Okay, they stopped. Zinyak's destruction of Earth had a profound impact on the afterlife. To heaven, it was a logistical nightmare. St. Peter's meticulous nature drove purgatory wait times to unbearable levels. Meanwhile, in hell, where souls in pain were used as currency, it created a new era of prosperity for the wickedly enterprising. This economic boom resulted in the coffers of hell to be overflowing, which in turn piqued the interest of the most notorious man that sailed the seven seas. Long had Blackbeard been a thorn in Satan's side, robbing tax collectors on a semi-regular basis. But the promise of an immeasurable fortune drove him to be even bolder. An arrangement was reached. Blackbeard would provide information on strategic targets in exchange for a share of the profit. Johnny, who was interested in murder, not money, happily agreed. So I'm just giving up all my dough. I give no Fs about money at all. I grant ye the ability to summon my crew whenever they're needed. I get to keep the hammer though, right? Alright, I can summon what? Oh, I can summon imps. Alright. Glyphs, okay. I got God's hammer though. Let's go to a summon tutorial, why not? Alright, matey. It's time for your lesson. Let's summon me favorite scurvy riddled hellion, the imp. Why don't you start off by summoning an imp to take out those enemies? Okay, how many can I summon though? Oh, okay. So that's how you summon an imp. You just gotta put him on him and you kill him. Okay. okay. Now let's practice your aim. Take down the demons on the islands. I can't summon the imp no more. Okay, so. Okay, cool. Like a, it's like a gunshot. Where's my next one? Okay. Few things are as rewarding as pressing someone into service, am I right? Now get going. There's a whole wide world waiting to be plundered. Alright. That's cool. Nice little addition to the game. Mm. I may never use it, though. I got God's hammer. That's all I need. Okay, so I gotta go rally Shakespeare. Who did? I can switch characters. Oh, that's dope. I'm out of here though. Yeah, I raided a Centerpol office and found information on where the president is being kept. Evidently, they've been trapped in some sort of soul crystal inside Satan's palace. Breaking in is an impossibility. Your best bet to save them is to continue to try to draw Satan out of his palace. Let me run around here. Dang, I ain't got no sprint. Nothing. Hold on. 
I'm almost there though. Let's see what these things can do. Who's next? <laughs> you see him running with his hands up? He was like, no. Muscle move. Get it. Woo! Woo! Lights up. William Shakespeare, humanity's greatest playwright, and hell's most diabolical purveyor of entertainment, looks on as a brave mortal on an Orphean quest enters. The bard's interest is piqued, and he looks to test his visitor's mettle. <sighs> uh oh. Get it. The masked tragedies were used to enemies cowering as they approached. But soon they realized that they faced a foe with courage and nobility. Traits uncommon in the fires of perdition. Mmm. God, I got moves. Hey, where'd he go? How did he get all the way over there? Hold up. I'm on my way to get right. Oh! Good move. Hold up, though. I might need to switch my gat. Hold on. Now I'm about to come over here and wreck it. Ooh! Good move. Damn you. The inciting right. incident resolved. The time had come for rising. All right, hold up. Come on, got him right there. Hold up, though. Man. Nah, I want some of those imps. How you how you levitating oh, like that? I wish I was like you. Come on, die, sucker, die. The battle raged on below, and as bullets and blood flew, the bard arched a curious eyebrow. Could this mortal be the exact thing that Shakespeare needed? Here we go, hold up. Head shot, can I get that head shot? Your soul, this battle is far from over. Uh oh. Arise. And now, Act Three. What up, though? I'm gonna catch his death, though. I don't think I was actually hurting him, but. You gotta try harder than that, Satan. I'm just trying to figure out, like, who else is here? Right, let me see if I can. Oh, headshot. Bang, bang. You will die and make no sign. The conflict resolved. Okay. Shakespeare yeah. eagerly awaited meeting the champion that dispatched so many of his men. Undoubtedly, they were here for the Bard's aid. And while happy endings were not a thing found in hell, Shakespeare always had a soft spot for company. Sure I get all these guns. All right, no, in the not bad. The living, William Shakespeare is regarded as one of the most prolific playwrights of all time. However, to the denizens of hell, the bard is seen in a far different light. 
After selling his soul for fame and adoration, Shakespeare served in hell as Satan's spy master general. In doing his duty, Shakespeare would punish the souls he was investigating by forcing them to perform in grotesque passion plays for Satan's amusement. But in a Twelfth Night-esque twist, Shakespeare found himself living a double life. While he projected an image of cruelty, his heart was as soft as Jezebel's. In secret, he would tutor her on the classics and act out the works of his mortal days. When Satan found out, he cast Shakespeare out of the palace, believing that the poet would be tormented by the populace of hell, far out of Jezebel's sight. But Satan had not counted on the bard's cunning. Embracing his persona of master torturer, Shakespeare and his followers, the tragedies, took root in the entertainment district, biding their time for revenge. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that was a pretty good thing. So Shakespeare called forth the deus ex machina to bestow our protagonist with the arcane power of horse stomp. Uh-oh, got my stomp power. All right, let's see. It's saving. Okay, I know I can use that. Okay, okay, I'm not worried about all that. Oh! Diversion of Revenge, finally kill with Dex again and again, make him pay what he did, St. Stillwater. All right, now, I'm not gonna go through that tutorial, but what I will do is, I will give you guys some, uh, where's it at, where's it at? Not control options, no. There we go, subtitles. Subtitles for the win. Long had Shakespeare conspired with Blackbeard, for it was the bar. I know I gotta go through the stomp tutorial. It's nothing I can do. Provided the it's all right. I'm gonna go through it. Right, up. The mortal stands in the training grounds, eager to try out his new force stomp power on the group of demons in front of them. Act one, scene two, in which our protagonist kills more. Act two, in which our protagonist is greeted by foul imps. Act three, in which our protagonist learns that Force Stomp even works on flying enemies, enabling them to remove a dark inciter's shield before shooting them to death with bullets. The day is won. And the curtain closes on our noble hero. All right, that was easy enough. Let's see what we got now. Time to hop into the next one. All right, time to rally Vlad. I'm gonna figure out a way to get out of here. Yeah. All right. Come on, get up. Got a touchdown. Oh, I'm hot. Nice. Well, I guess I can get some clusters on the way. Damn Souls Orientation Guide, Chapter 30, The Halo. Forged by God himself, my Halo was a repository of great power. I spent millennia harnessing its might, and even then, I barely scratched the surface of what it was capable of. I'm trying to figure out... Okay. Uh-oh. Let them win. Come on, you can get there, you can get there, dive, dive. Ah. So that's what I gotta do to keep my, my flight and see I gotta dive every so often. Just to give myself that momentum. 
Look at that. Okay. What up, though? Sorry, buddy. I'm gonna get this work. Mm-hmm. Gotcha. Oh, what up? Oh! Nice move. Oh. Yo, I love being Johnny. I love, love Johnny. Johnny, you are the freaking man, dog. Alright, I'm gonna enter the person. Because they just keep spawning, like. Waste of my time, I guess. Really, though? Did I just enter SpongeBob land? Duh. What? Who knows, man? Saints Row. Man. you why'd they use the short version of the song this is the short version oh yeah the wipers on the bus go swish 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 what oh, i'm not even stabbing nobody <laughs> my mom had like 80 of them God! Mm, not in the butt though I didn't even see nothing. Darn it. Almost died. Hold up, though. I can use this. Is that all you got? Kill. Come on. Where'd he go? Oh. Good shot. I need a scope. He's dead. Let us return to my castle, so we may plot our next steps in proper surrounds. Are you gonna give me a gift? Johnny led Vlad back to his castle, which since his incarceration became a haven for frat parties and squatters. <laughs> but the systematic impaling of trespassers would have to wait. Vlad was a man of his word, and was eager to provide intel that could aid in hobbling Satan's armies. Bestow upon you the Stygian cold fire. I'm getting all these hot moves, though. Alright, no need to know all that info. Oh, Omega? Say something about the Omega, though. 
I brought you to this inferno to teach you about the power I have granted you. Cold fire is an aura, which means you must activate the power and get close to an enemy before they will feel the cold embrace of the Stygian flames. Try it against these demons. Well done. Okay. Now here comes a dark inciter. Use your aura, then get close to him to take down his shield. From there you can finish him off with your pistol. You've done it. Doesn't it feel okay. good to watch an enemy burn? I like it a little bit. Don't got me like jizzing though. It was a pretty okay move. Pretty okay. Alright, now I gotta rally the twins. Okay. Need to rest the wings. Yeah. There we go. Take that momentum, baby. Don't slow down. Brainstorming location found. It's cool enough. What up, though? Something ain't right. I gotta get up this wall. Alright, so. Do I gotta go all the way up this wall? Hold up. Lost count on these things. All right, where am I going? Where are they? Okay. Should I just drop? All right, let me see. Okay, maybe this door get me in here. Yep. Ooh. I know these twins. Y'all came to hell. Oh. We're standing in a parking garage. I don't like it either, but Centerpool isn't giving us many options. I can't believe they tried to force us out. I can't believe you forgot the mimosas. I think we have bigger problems. I don't think you realize how much I love mimosas. I can't help but notice that people are trying to kill you. Yeah, they're really big on that here. What did you do? Is now really a good time? We can wait until we're done shooting people. Well, I'm great at multicasting. Remember when we offered you a deal on that airplane and you responded by killing everyone? Yeah. It's like that, but worse. Go! Oh. They really didn't have a chance. Hold up. Oh, nice move. DDT? He's the. You got more people? Let me go outside and handle these suckers. He said. That'll do it. Alright, what gun? How about God's hammer? No! That's how you do it. Where are they? Okay, they're flying. Okay. So, let me get my imp joint. Oh. Oh, 
This joint spit. Hey, Viola. Hurt, though. I thought you should know that Kinsey misses you. Really? That's so sweet. Who's Kinsey? You remember Kinsey. She was that hacker that Matt Miller hated. Isn't she crazy? You know, she really grows on you. Alright, now I gotta kill some demons. Dang, where you at, bro? He gonna get he gonna get this guy's hammer though. You got me fucked up. You think I ain't, you ain't gonna get this guy's hammer though? Damn. I'm about to, I'm about to take this L though. Woo! Things ain't looking too good. Hold up. I could save him, god damn it. Two back to day. Hooray. I like the knives though. After being reunited in hell, Kiki and Viola wasted no time in doing what they do best. Facilitate the running of businesses. However, the De Winter sister's success did not sit well with other would-be power players in hell. The sisters' operations all came under attack at once, forcing them on the run. Soon, the twins found themselves on the receiving end of an offer they couldn't refuse. After all, it was better to own one-fifth of something than to be dead. One-fifth, though? Damn. Just giving up, just regular old nothings. You helped us, now let us help you. Here's a little something made popular by another group of sisters, the Gorgons. What? The Gorgons. Oh, I get this tank though. Let's check out this blast tutorial. All right, Dane's letting us use his Ultor training room to test out your stone blast power. First of all, so go ahead and blast these demons to turn them to stone. After they're petrified, you can use your pistol to shatter them. Wow, that's pretty dope. Too easy. Nice. Stone blast is especially useful on flying demons like this one. Well, he just he just straight up fell like. All right, now let's see you drop a few more. Oh, so you gotta throw it directly at him. But it hit them too. Okay. I'm done, right? The blast will also take down the shield of a dark insider, leaving it vulnerable to gunfire. Take this dark insider. I think you've got the gist of it. All right, let's go. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is your boy IKC signing out. Make sure you leave a like and a comment. If you want to hit me up personally, go ahead and hit me up on Twitter at iPodKingCarter. I'm going to see you guys in the next episode, all right? Peace. Yeah.